Well, when we first arrived in Hot Springs Village early this morning, this is what we saw. The ground covered with debris, power poles split in half, and several buildings destroyed. Neighbors coming together to clean up what they could and, as always, showing the true spirit of Arkansas. We know many businesses were impacted by last night's tornado. Channel 7's Kayla Christian met today with the owner of Village Nutrition. They have been forced to close their doors after last night's storms. She joins us now live from Hot Springs Village with their story. Kayla. Yes, Chris, that's right. And this is actually the second time that Village Nutrition has been hit by a natural disaster in the last two years. And they're just hoping that they can recover from this one as soon as possible. A one-stop shop for whole health needs, Village Nutrition was shocked to hear the store was damaged and without power. I could see that a telephone pole had fallen down on the roof of my store. And that was just crazy, you know, and I, I knew that I had lost electric and I was running on a UPS that was keeping the, the network alive. But, you know, eventually that died. And so, you know, I didn't know anything until this morning. Owner David Cohen got footage from security cameras unable to get to the store as they were also taking shelter nearby. A lot of wind and just a lot of rain and just constant pounding on our house. Now having to wait and see just how much of a loss the business will take. You know, we're going to lose sales because I don't have the merchandise, right? And I won't be able to get that until next Friday or Saturday. So, you know, and people are going to be disappointed. What can I tell you? You know, it's, you know. Now, though Village Nutrition is losing business, they were happy to report that they were able to donate all of their perishable food items to a food bank so that it can go to good use for those in need. On your side, I'm Kayla Christian. Good news there indeed. Kayla, thanks very much.